Remember when we were children and we used to do whatever your mother and father said, no matter what they said, we never really thought about it because we were like real young and 10, I guess, like, even younger. Looking back on it now, I'm going to talk about some crazy, uh, some crazy lies that our parents told us that we believed. <laughs> Shall I go ahead with it? <laughs> Number one. It's just chicken. Eat it. Chicken, is it? It's just chicken. Okay. It doesn't look like chicken to me. Cut the bullshit. We know that's fish. Because you know what they say, though? Because every kid likes chicken. And they're going to eat it if they think it's chicken. Alright, I'm going to be honest. Those fish fingers, they kind of tasted a little bit like chicken, probably because they were like processed and they probably were chicken, to be honest. Who knows? Shit, I didn't like to eat them on this. Santa's always watching you. I'll call Santa. I'll write him a letter and say that you're being bad. I'll be good for the rest of my life. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'll be good, I'll be good. Every kid wanted presents, so why wouldn't they say that? Don't drink coffee. It'll stunt your growth. Really? It'll stunt my growth. I actually believed that up until I was about 18 because mum said it would stunt my growth and I wanted to play basketball. I doubt coffee has anything to do with your growth. It's probably good because they didn't want me to be a real hyper. It was energetic drinking coffee. <clears throat> Oh my god, this one is the biggest lie, and it still happens today. It's been going on for 21 years. Dinner's ready. Is dinner ready, mum? Cut the shit. I walk downstairs, dinner's not ready. There's not even plates on the table. You're still cooking it. Why would you yell at me saying dinner's ready when it's not ready? That's a lie. Lying. Liar. Stop. Liar. If you sneeze with your eyes open, it'll fall out. I think it's pretty much impossible to sneeze with your eyes open anyway because every time I do it, I don't want my eyes to fall out though so maybe that was in the back of my mind when I was sneezing. It's a pretty messed up lie to tell your kids, especially when they're like five. Your eyes are going to fall out if you sneeze with your eyes. What if they forget one time like this? And they thought their eyes were gone. Cracking your knuckles will give you arthritis. No, what? It will not give you arthritis. That is a lie, you just don't want me to crack my knuckles because it sounds disgusting. Who likes my Drake tea? Yeah. Chocolate gives you pimples. Don't eat it. Well, guess what? It was Easter about four weeks ago, and I ate chocolate a lot. And I'm still eating chocolate. Where are my pimples? There isn't one. What they? What they? What they? Get? You're straight lying to us. You just don't want us to eat all the chocolate because it's bad for us, kinda. Oh my god. The ice, mum. The ice cream man. Ice cream man only plays music when it's run out of ice cream. Dog, go on I've never seen the ice cream man not run out of ice cream then, because every time I see it, it's gone. Some stupid song. When I went to school, and I used to, I used to not eat my fruit or lunch, and I'd only eat like the chips and the chocolate, so mum would always say, if you don't eat your sandwich or your fruit, the lunch lady will call me. I'll find out. I doubt you have the lunch lady's number, Mum. Doubt it. She wasn't creeping on me, making sure if I ate my sandwich. I'm pretty sure she had better things to do than that. Oh, is Jackson eating his fruit today? I don't even know her. Why would she care about me? But when I was younger, I thought, oh shit, I can't. Throw in the bin. No lunch lady, I'm safe. Apparently, they were making secret phone calls. Doubt it. If you sit too close to the TV, it'll give us square eyes. Square eyes, we like. Square eye. I don't know why I believe that. I don't know why everyone believes that. Actually, definitely comment if you believe that because I used to think that I'd get square eyes, so I used to sit back. I used to actually tell my sisters, oh my god, get back from the TV because you're going to get square eyes. Watch out for that. You don't want square eyes. Like, they're circle for a reason. No square. If you keep making those stupid faces and the wind changes, your face will be stuck like that. Well, I don't want my face to look like this, do I? Because that would be very stupid. Since when was I ever making those faces anyway, Mum? Jeez, I don't walk out of this. I don't. I didn't walk out when I was five years old. Going, oh, off to school. Hey, let's go. Oh shit, the wind changed. Oh, oh fuck, everyone's gonna think I look like a dickhead today. Biggest lie I've ever had. What? I don't understand. Kids are so stupid, they believe everything. Right, what about when you're in a road trip, when you're on a massive roadie and you're like this? Mimi, Mimi, are we there yet? Mimi, we're almost there, kids. Cool, I'll listen to another seven songs and watch 16 movies. We're almost there. That's about 48 hours left. Oh my goodness.
Christmas. We're almost there. We just left home. We're almost there. Just so we'd shut up. If you don't eat your greens, you're not going to have any muscles. Of course, I'm like, yeah, I'm a boy, I need muscles. Still don't have any muscles. I've been eating greens for 70 years. <gasps> Biggest lie. Always eat my greens. No muscle, I'm skinny as shit. Skinny as shit. Anyway, guys, that's it for today's video. I really hope you liked it, and I hope you can relate to that. Give it a thumbs up if you did hear those lies as a child or any of them and comment which one and comment ones that I didn't do because I'd like to know about the ones that you got told when you were a kid. So yeah, comment below, share this with your friends, subscribe if you haven't and yeah, peace out, a town.